Hello MechWarriors, how's it going and welcome to another episode of MechWarrior Online where we are playing the Corsair today. It's the holiday season, a lot of people are coming to farm the events and that means there is a lot of missiles on the board. What are we doing? We can either join them or we can counter them with a good old Corsair 7A with four AMSs and we're gonna just destroy all the missiles in the sky being protected. Now I got a special build for you today that includes four large lasers. We have a Gauss rifle, so we have something to shoot early on. We have something that can shoot at range and then when we are in the mid game and mid range, we can shoot the large lasers on top of it. Alpha Strike is pretty solid with 51 damage. The mech is a bit wacky in its design though, because we have two large lasers on the left arm, then actually on the right arm, then we have two on the left side torso, the alignment is not really great, and then there's a Gauss rifle on top of that, so managing your weapons is a little bit clunky on this mag, but it kind of works. And what I like is that we have four AMS, four anti-missile systems that keep the skies clear of any missiles, and we are kind of protected and, you know, get a good match score because of AMS. That's really good. We are running a light engine 325, which brings us to only 55 kph, but I think it's good enough for a 95 ton like that. We have 69 armor on the arms, which is great. And uh, yeah, I kind of like the Corsair because of it looks. Uh, I mean, look at this. This is just a crazy, wacky pirate mech with a bulldozer shovel right next to the cockpit. And it's, uh, it's cool. It's really cool. Let's take a look at the skills before we get into this here. And as you can see, we got magazine capacity 1. Just one, because we don't need more than that. We have two and a half tons of ammo. And with that, we should be fine for most of the games. Of course, we're going to take all the laser duration in the world and heat gen as much as possible so we can shoot as often as possible. I also wanted AMS overload one and two. It kind of makes sense when you have four of them. You get a great amount of benefits out of that. It really makes it so that you can get shot by a lot of missiles and they will get destroyed like crazy. On top of that, good chunk of armor and a bit of skeletal density to keep you alive a bit longer. And then what we got is heat containment, cool run, radar deprivation, as well as a double cool shot and a UAV today. And that's the build, everybody. I wish you all a lot of fun in the two games that are coming now. And if you have that, as always, don't forget to leave a rating. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. If you want to support the channel, the best way to do it is on Patreon. Link is down below in the description. And now it's time to hit the battlefield. All right, first game of the day. We are playing the Frozen City Classic. It's kind of foggy here. And yeah, we're going to set up at Kappa, I believe, because we got some range on our weapons. We have a Gauss rifle that shoots at the thousand meters. Sadly... I don't know if we should go for heat or night vision. I think heat vision is the best one we can get here. Just, uh, you know, enabling us to see through the fog. That's kind of crucial. So yeah, we're gonna wait a little bit until the enemies come to Bravo 4 and then we're gonna shoot the crap out of them. That's the whole game plan. I have nothing else. It, it's just it. This is just it. I'm gonna set up here so that we have a little bit of cover. We can pull back to this little snow drift that we are standing on top right now. And uh, yeah, that's the battle plan. So, let's see if we can actually find some enemies. As a UAV, I'll try to take that real quick. And we took it. That was good. UAV down. So, team is pushing forward a little bit, so I don't want to fall behind. Therefore, I will push with them. I'm gonna take a keen look on the right side, on the right flank. It's a very mad dog. That's a hit. That's another hit. SRM Brawler getting softened up already. Nice, I like it. That is a problem for him. Couldn't quite get him. One of us is dead. Like, what? Like, why? Seriously. Too late. We can do that. Oh god, that's a full fist of Daka I ate. Oh no. Uh-huh, not gonna happen. I'm gonna pull back. These guys are aggressive. Like, by just by their demeanor, just by what they are doing. It looks like they really are out for blood, so we're gonna take a little bit of cover. I'm gonna shoot that Corsair again. Ah, oh, a little bit too high. The moment I shot, he was dropping down. That's everybody, right? Hmm, that's like everybody, everybody. There's a light mech. It's kind of pushing forward. It's gonna be a problem, but I still want to hold this line. Let's go ahead and hit this. Nope, I couldn't. All right, so I'm gonna switch position to a little bit more to the right side. One and three. This is not good. Like, this is really bad. <laughs> Why are we losing the fight here? Okay. Gotta hit in. It's the only thing I can really do right now. Okay. Let me get that sun spider. Nope. There's a light mech. I don't know if you could see him skirmish about. Ah, oh, man. I need to make this whole thing wide, I think. All right. Enemies first, then the UAV. Okay. Can do it now. Nope. Never mind. It's taken. No, it's not. 
Is it even relevant to the fight? I don't think so. Gotta hit in on the timber. Timber is core, which is great. So we might even get the kill on this guy. Uh, and yeah, it's kind of peaking day today. I'm gonna go and uh, reposition again a little bit. Still wonder where the light mag went. There is a loco somewhere. If he's getting behind us, uh, we have a problem. And we are now the outermost position on the right flank. So we could get flanked easily. But I think we're gonna try to get some kills here. Alright, here we go. Yeah, let's get him. Come on. Oh, too high. I'm not really afraid of his LRMs. I mean, they deal a little bit of damage. I wish I had another UAV, by the way. That would be extremely helpful. Let's wait. Let's wait for the team. I'm a little bit too overzealous going on that flank. I mean, we are making some progress here. We are making some moves. That's the good news. But what are the enemies gonna do? Gonna shoot it. There's a guy. What the hell was that? Oh, my mouse. <laughs> and my aim, basically. Uh, always blame the periphery. That's how you do it as a gamer. He's still down here. All right, we're gonna push into the city. Not really my preferred spot, I have to say. Cannot hit anything here. All right, we're gonna again make it a bit wider. The whole situation. That's the timber. We got him, two and three. Finally, there is some movement on the board. All right, let's keep going. Oh, oh, yeah, actually. Got some more damage on the hell spawn. There's more people coming, right? I tried. It didn't work. And here comes the brawler. We can destroy some SRMs, but not all of them. He's more afraid. Yeah, he's more afraid than I am. Absolutely. And that was a horrible miss. Cool shot. Let's keep going. Uh, the Hellspawn is probably XL, so he's gonna die. Mm, yeah, this is going quite well. He's light engine. Give me that laser beam. I mean, if I cannot hit anything with the Gauss today, I'm just gonna use my laser weapons. Uh, the fight is escalating in right in front of in front in front of us, uh, as well as right here. Uh, yeah, and that's a kill as well as Charlie three guys. Charlie three, light mech in front of us. Cannot hit for the love of God today. Not with the Gauss at the very least. I want to push this. Is this a bit overzealous again? I don't know. Pushing Bravo three. Oh, these guys are kind of uh, getting that guy alone. Is that a good thing? We have support. That's good. Where did the Huntsman go? There he is. Yay, we missed again. <laughs> oh, this is not helping. Also, we are falling. Why are we falling? I don't want to fall. All right, let's go up here. What do we have in front of us? A sunny spider. And that is a hit. I mean, point blank. And then there's a light mech still, right? Unsee? Once he is dead, still low signal, that's the Locust that we were waiting for. Come on, where are you, buddy? People are shooting, things are escalating. I don't see him. There he is, okay. Let's see. No, 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 no. My Gauss game is really bad today. <laughs> Keep him spotted. Keep him spotted, guys. Uh, we actually kind of have to go to the capture points as well. So I think I'm going to sit my big, big metal butt on Theta. It's not coming from here. So we're gonna watch for the smoke. By the way, sorry for the black and white, but without heat vision, we would see nothing at all. So let's uh, let's keep it up. So yeah, we're gonna go to Theta, capture that thing. The Locust is probably actually making a wide berth around it and tries to get Epsilon. Never mind. Theta is being decapped already. So we're gonna do this now. Let me see if I am actually right and if he wants to go to Epsilon. Because if so, I am ready to shoot that guy. And hopefully we're gonna survive this. Let's see. Okay, 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 okay. Let me see. Nobody here. So... Kappa, you say? Really? Alright. I mean, he's probably gonna try to get to Epsilon. Again, keep him spotted. So, that's that's an actual good move. I was not I was not looking at the, at the upper screen there. Right, they have it. They will probably disengage now. Try to go to Epsilon. I'm ready to intervene. So we're gonna set up here. Where is he? Probably coming from here. Left side. Right side. Through the city or not. Where does he go? Is he going to Gamma instead? This is interesting. 
I'm really trying to guard this place, but I don't see anybody. This is my Epsilon. Nobody's gonna take that. He's actually going to Gamma. Wow! Good move! He's actually going there, and I thought he would be intercepted by those guys, but no! Nicely done! Still staying close to Epsilon. That is very important. Actually, you know what he's gonna do next? I believe he's gonna disengage from Gamma as soon as he has that. And, I mean, he's kind of fighting right now. 38% on the quick draw. He's jumping. He's disengaging, going through the tunnel. That's what I would do. Nope, he's moving to Kappa again. Wow, this little Locus. Look at him. Look at him. I, I'm just doing snapshots here. I don't think that I'm gonna hit anything from this. There we go, we got him. Wow. What a game. That was a quiet long one. It could have actually gone both ways. Nice. <laughs> Hi, YouTube. Hi, Mickey. <laughs> so, let's take a look at the end score here. Again, my laser game was okay. My Gauss game, not so much. I gotta practice that, definitely. But hey, we dealt seven freaking hundred damage, and that's perfect. That's pretty good. We got two killing blows, we got eight assists, 400 taken, and... 496 missiles destroyed. That was the first round, everybody. Let's go over to the next one and see how this will go down. Alrighty, second game of the day. We are playing the Terra Therma. We are playing uh, Conquest. <laughs> okay. And yeah, I think, you know what? I think I'm gonna go to the Fox 7 area because we have one guy, a Vulcan, going there. The rest is going around the left side, is going to Epsilon. It might be bad to go there, but we might have some other friends coming with us. It's cool if we have like four or five mechs on that spot. More than that would be definitely too much because there is, uh, yeah, there's, there's uh, not enough space. Uh, and there's a lot of talk right now. You can probably not hear it. They're really loud. I need to probably turn them down a little bit. Um, can I real quick? Let's go settings. Let's go audio. Let's go playback level a little bit lower. Yeah, better. All right, so you cannot hear them because, you know, I separated my voice channel from my game in-game channel. So, here we go. We're gonna try to contest Theta and we're gonna try to set up. There's a lot of stuff happening already. A Jenner and a Commando. SRM's on the Commando. And if we can if we can establish some dominance there, that would be absolutely fantastic. Commando is trying to disengage into our direction, realizes that this is full of mechs, and then is turning around again. That's really good. Oh, buddy, don't back up into me. I, I, I tried, I tried. I can do this. This is good. Ow. Really want to do that? Let's go. I mean, I can. I can hold this for a while. It's a piranha. Tried to hit leg. Didn't get it. Uh, hello, little one. That's a problem. Didn't really want to hit my friend. No, he was going to the other side. What the hell is going on here? This is insane! Absolutely insane. Uh, there's a UAV, I know, but they are max as well. And they are more important than any UAV right now. There are actually two of them. Alright, let's quickly take this. And then we're gonna quickly take this. Investing into um, negative vision. Holy hell. Should have shot earlier. Um, yo, guys, what's going on with Theta? Why is nobody here anymore? Are you really chasing one light mech with five mechs? I cannot hit anything. I'm gonna hold this here. Let's take it slow. Let's take it slow. Like, like, super slow. He's not aware. That Gauss. That Gauss rifle. I'm not happy. I am not happy with that. Alright, so we're gonna shoot people that we can shoot. That's a hit. That's good. Got some more damage in and now they are aware and they are going for me. Right? All right, so we got the reinforcements on the center again. Uh, let's get into Theta and help out on the other side of the battlefield. So we got a Marauder with us. That's great. That's a, that's a nice battle buddy. Holy crap, that escalated. Where did the Rifleman go? I have no idea. Uh, yeah, we need a firing line right here. There's an Atlas coming and he is angry. Okay, okay, okay. Gonna help out. I'm trying at the very least. We hit him. Nice. Atlas is still here. Hi, Jenner. We hit him. Okay, here comes the Atlas. 
I'm gonna pull back a little bit. Let the dire wolf do the dire wolf things. And, uh, I mean, the line is holding. That's the good news. The bad news is there are still a lot of enemies to kill. Mm-hmm. All right. AMS is rattling like crazy. I should be in the fight. I should not pull back that much. Stay a bit more engaged. <laughs> and here comes the flanking, huh? Uh, I'm not entirely sure. No, nope, not like this. No, I don't like that. Go away. Go away. Not me. I'm getting out of here. Those racks, man. Those racks. One and freaking five? They are coming from Fox 7 now, correct? Is that a thing? I mean, we have no chance to cap anything right now. We have nothing. Yeah, I can contest that. Kind of? Oh boy, this is where they are pushing. That's a kill, perfect. Okay. Uh, and they are bringing their frontliners to the freaking front. Actually. That's a miss. Bad. That could have been a kill. Should have been a kill. I mean, we are kind of coming back from this. Not too bad. No, now we're getting shot in the butt. All right. That's a freaking Viper. Yeah, he got me. He completely got me. There's nothing I can do. Oh, I can. I can do something. That is being patient. Not overheating. Okay, okay, okay. I'm overheating now. And I'm dead in the water. In the lava. What a game, everybody. What a freaking game. That escalated so crazily. <laughs> Holy macaroni. I have no words for that. These enemies were so damn aggressive. Look at them. Dervish has a good matchup against the commander with the streaks. What he needs is a consistent lock. And I don't think he's gonna get him, right? Is that it? Uh, maybe. He's lagged. Yeah, this is it. Everybody's balling up on him. Um, that's, that's it. That's game, I guess. I mean, we are losing the Cavs. We are losing the fights. I need to know how many... How many uh, big, big assault mags they had? Because it felt like they had all of them. They wouldn't die. And they also had all of the light mags. It's like, oh, so much stuff going on there. I saw a King Crab. I saw an Atlas. I saw a Rifleman. I mean, uh, Jenner, um, Viper. They had a bunch of Vapor Eagles. So it was an actual good mixed team. And I think their gears kind of worked better in conjunction in the, you know, in the end. But hey. It's good. It was a good game. It set us under pressure. We didn't win. But that is fine. That's, um, he, the guy, the guy he, uh, who's talking right now is saying that we had a bunch of people chasing one enemies in the early game. I think this is what actually broke our neck in the mid game. Taking four or five mechs or one, and then our big block of metal in the center kind of collapsed and crumbled from that point. Again, having fire co power combined is what you want to do. Anyway, we got 694 damage on the board, we got 538 taken, we got a kill, 5 assists, as well as 200 missiles destroyed. But that was it for today, everybody. I hope you enjoyed it. Have a great Christmas time, enjoy the holidays, spend some time with friends and family, and uh, I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye.